Greetings and welcome back to Oni. Uh, hello there, Captain Motor. Good evening to you. Hello, Philip. Flipstar, I hope you're all having a great uh, uh, Sunday. God damn it, every time. A great Sunday. <laughs> uh, we're back and we're somewhat lucky since we had a bit of a crash last time yesterday, uh, which kicked us out of the game, kicked myself out of my, of my PC. Uh, I don't know what happened. I take it, I don't know. Probably some issue with my mainboard because all the other components have since been this is not vacuum, right? Have since been replaced and improved upon. So um, I don't know. It should not be temperatures or anything like that. Maybe the power stages. I don't know. Um, anyways, we're back, and the lucky part is I checked the vault and uh, we just saved like uh, 10 seconds before the crash so we didn't lose a lot of time here so that's good um, I wanted you to close this off on the other side open up the other space here right so you can just um, this can be closed off that's all natural gas this is for now still closed off here uh, yeah so this is gonna be natural gas no foreign alien elements uh, put the ceiling on top it's gonna be insulated and done seems good uh, yes I did uh, activate my notification thingy that now brings the idle stuff over here which is completely useless because we have a thousand dupes and they are all gonna idle um, so that's not really something for this specific campaign except maybe if we put down a ton of hamster wheels that would be an option. Uh, also, I want to, I didn't do it, but I will want to get a few more mods to remove all these other nonsense notifications. Yeah. Um, but since you're all idle, I should give you some jobs to do. Did we vacuum all of this out? There's still some CO2 here. Um, this is fine. So let's get rid of that CO2 and open the rest up. As for the right hand side, I do want more room up here and then we go inside well then we have to figure out how exactly what we want to build all this uh, right and to do that more importantly we need to have something else entirely which is metal which we have built this steam turbine setup for uh, which is open and this is closed yeah right I thought I could vacuum this into space except I can't because we closed this off. Um, in that case, would you kindly close this real quick so we don't uh, put in too much oxygen, right? Just close this off like so. Uh, this can stay a vacuum. It was even a nice filled up thingy once. Oh well. Or or we could put in a bit of oil and water on top. How much oil is that? Yeah, too much oil anyways. Alright. We'll do it that way. Um, I go start again. We empty the oil. And we do need water anyways. Uh, how cold is it? Two degrees. And we should have some salt water or something. We have it here. Uh, in that case we just dump it here. It can be open for now. That won't make a difference. Um, our beans didn't get dropped. That's nice. We have what? we have one bean down here. We do want that moved. And I kind of want you all to be together. Right? Only two idols. Oh, cool. Uh, open that up. I still want this removed but more, uh, moved up basically. Yeah. That's one bean I got. I hate it. I gotta select all the different stages of staleness separately. Yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> uh, I could try and get them 
refreshed by planting all of them. How many is that? 18. How much is this? It's almost perfect. So why not do that for a real quick second? So we don't have to fear for the low priority, not low priority, but the low freshness stuff. Uh, you can be all open. This can be removed. But, um, who's idling and why? You guys? You dug out the, all this. I do want it. Do I know? It would be nice to have some nonsense down here, aka some building materials. Well, I guess we get them from up here. No reason for you not to derp around. And um, train your legs or whatever. Uh, right. This I do want to change a bit so we can have the power transformed. All right. I need more than one transformer, don't I? Um, <laughs> uh, space is limited. Yes, okay, sure. Do we have room over there? I do want to change this a bit, so not really. Uh, we could have these at the bottom. Yada, yada, yada. There's anything in here. But do we need this? Um, don't need these bits. Uh, the carbon dioxide, 300 and a few grams. And actually, I want those. Well, I guess you can be connected for now. I want the CO2 to be moved. Uh, I've had a thing. So ultimately, let's curve you go up by one. It really does not matter all that much. Um, I want to open this vent. Yes, I want to open the 500 degrees CO2 vent. Uh, makes no sense right now. Probably. But uh, the right inside part of the base is supposed to be part of the eventual Snickster farm. So, and that is going to be, in general, a hot spot. Which means there's no reason not to put all the CO2 in there. Uh, it's already getting a bit warm from this side anyways. And uh, more importantly, to stop the warmth from coming in, I would like you all to put up a wall here all the way to the vent and on the other side of the vent. Can you reach the top here? Um, for now, yes, because you can stand on top of this. So this can be four high from here and you can reach through the bottom and I uh, want to make this maybe as high as the supply teleporter, I guess. Talk about uh, the supply teleporter though. Are you gonna be interfering? I need a good spot to check our height again. Um, this is the rocket, a 9 extra, 44. And below that we can start building something. Um, what do we have here? I don't think I need insulation whatsoever. It's ice media and I don't want insulation. Actually, I would like to have ice. <laughs> um, so this would be our highest level. It's not going to be affected by rocket exhaust if we build hydro rockets. Um, you are here. The next one would be here. We will also have liquid on the highest level. We don't want that to be evaporated. So we would want to go here. And uh, well, if you want to align it, maybe put it too lower. So this would be our top floor, yes. That fits with both teleporters. How do you fit in? Oh, this is fine. It's actually perfect. It's another four levels. That's going to be our top level. I guess we can put it in place right away. It doesn't really make much of a difference. Uh, as for this side, we will want to have a ladder going down. Mm, 
where? One uh, right next to the thing. Yeah, sure, right next to the thing. So we put the ladder, put the ladder here. You can go all the way to the top. And this is a proper floor. Now this would be the floor, right? So you would go over to the side like so. I have to take this up and that and that. You can go down. The CO2 heat shouldn't leak out too much. And we want it all open on the top. We want it open on the top. Uh, so the other gases can go and leave. And then we're gonna flood all this gas out, we flush it out, uh, push it to the top, and this will all be CO2 and we don't have to vacuum it, because, well, it's gonna be CO2. Um, another thing, you are a bit warm. We brought in a lot of ice before. I think we can do this differently. We should go ahead and use pipes for this instead. Uh, that isn't the best at conducting heat, but it's better than the other nonsense. So, this seems to be appropriate. Or do I want to go up here? I guess... I guess many things. Um, I mean... It seems almost better. Because I also want to use the steam water, steam vent water, for my... oil production. So we can overwrite the center part here maybe. Or well, we want to have an extra pipe or an extra pipe, but yeah, whatever. Uh, you then go up and in here that works fine. Works just fine. Connect you down. Um, yeah. So priorities are difficult. I want this done. It's going to affect other buildings as well. I hate it. You're still a 9. Um, that was a 7. I want you to build a little ladder before you build the tile so you can reach it all at the same time. And don't have to come in from the top and then you can just access everything easily. So there's a that. Uh, and then the rest is whatever. And we want to go down here, somewhere. This will be in the way of things. Uh, if I go further to the right, I will he lose less heat. Have less heat bleeding down, I guess. Um, open up the hydrogen here. The chlorine, the bleach still needs to get out. Open this up. Uh, we're gonna down, gonna go down here and here, and then what? We can go up on top of the. That lily is sprouting on the obsidian tile. Now we can go onto the door, right? The security security door allows us to be on top of it, and we have a new entry lock. And this nonsense. I don't have to demolish it. It's not for now. And we can go down here. We get free sand, that's nice. The hydro can go up. And this is CO2 anyways. And so's all the rest at the bottom. Cool. Uh, also means I want to have the COT, COT, CO2 conserved. And not fed to the slicksters yet. Mm, I could also make this an entry point. Yes, open this up, like so. Put a bit of oil here. Yeah, that sounds good. A bit of oil. Uh, you're supposed to be emptied, so we have a another extra security layer here. Double and triple lock, actually. 
Okay, how much oil is that? A lot. If we put the oil here, not empty, and empty it, it's gonna come down. Uh, I will just go ahead and put a bit of a, a knob here. Make this too deep. Can you come down here? Make this one deep. The oil will drop into this and not go into our water storage, hopefully. Right, good. Um, this already is filtering out uh, the chlorine. We don't have any other gases here, realistically. I guess. Um, not that it matters too much. As for the CO2, okay, you're gonna be annoying. Let's remove that. As for the CO2. give you priority going up. For now, I will just out of sight, yeah, for now. Uh, you go up here, and then you join this, and then you just go over to the side and sprout your nonsense in here. Okay. Entry point. I don't want an entry point here. This is going to be hot. It's going to be too hot for the vicinity of my spawn and whatnot. Uh, you're also kind of cold, huh? Uh, kind of hot. Should be fine if I just put a temperature by a lot of ice here. It should absorb a lot of heat coming from down the... from from down here. What's your problem? This. Okay, and uh, these bodies of water, I will join them eventually for now. You have plenty of things to do, I guess. This is counting... Muck root. Are you accessing this? Because it's deceiving. Wait, I still saw no, okay, barbecue and meal ice, fine, good. Um yeah. Temps in here are kinda high. This is still nice and cold, so this should maybe cool it down. Here it starts at 30 ish degrees. The water's cooler. In part anyways. Um might make sense to make this into leave you open. Make this into how hot is that? I'll just dig all this up. Well this can stay I guess. Um we put a layer of insulation here. All the way to the abyssal light. I'll leave the sand here. Remove all of this all of this so the debris falls down uh, the layer of insulation is going to be above of the debris and that's going to be just fine yeah yeah it's a bit, inf a bit inf inefficient doing this first it's not a high priority but whatever uh, eight and seven. Or maybe it is a priority. What is the other thing we do? The whole this nonsense, that's fine. That nonsense. There's not much we're doing here. I just wanted to give you guys work. Um, and how's our reed fiber coming along? We made all the four suits we wanted in here. I gotta check my suits in here, I guess. We have two extra. They're supposed to go over to the other side, right? This is always export. And this is... Well, always exporting. Yeah, always export because it's on a 9. I put you on a 9 as well. So you can bring stuff here without sending it out. And I can restrict it. So we have one time the appropriate amount. Um, for now, just send those two atmospheres here. And eventually we want to send over read fiber, excess read fiber, and use that. Huh. If I do this, no. Excess read fiber and use that to make suits, suits locally. 
Sorry, I can close that. We can't go further. Okay. And we do then want to have a building here. A metal refinery. Uh, we are too far, too away from the ladder. Smart. Okay. Refinery. One or two. On the right. Or give some extra sight. Cool. Want to give some extra room, maybe this much. One space, two spaces. And one space in between, yeah. Sounds a good man. Powering will just be heavy but wire. It's gonna be annoying. Alright, heavy but wire. Good point. We kinda wanna get that out of here. Somehow. And we need to still get, well down here for one, get a third liquid on top of this. Are you ready besides all that? Yes. Uh, are you putting all the eggs in here? No. The eggs are for now going up here. Okay. And uh, apparently we have cuddle pips eggs. So, oh hello there, there's my son. In I see. Why? How did the water get displaced again? I don't get it. There should only be eggs. I can't see if it's anything else. And even if we have stinky air, we should have a storage bin for that. Seeds. What? Dirt clay. Wait, clay. I wanted to cut available soil here for the for for the research, but okay. Just do them all. Um, talk about bringing the wrong kind of critters. Don't do bugs. Thank you. Um, room size is not correct. I get distracted by so many things. Are you still correct? No, you're too small. By two? Three. Ninety-six we need. One, two, three, 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 three. Uh, can I replace that one without interference from the just to open it up for now. Um right, and uh, what's your issue again? Two tiles too many. Block that off. Okay. Scheinbach, Sun and Nymph. You are to be in here. How big, how long, how, how many bugs do we have in here? And this is the right size. Four. Okay. Um, we will transition to Sun, sun and Nymphs, I guess. Uh, this is going to be fine. We need the second liquid, right? Um, oh, and we made some ethanol for that, I remember. And that reminds me about, uh, reminds me of the, I won't think of the other, ethanol. Did I not mop any of that up? I guess not. Mop this one now. Uh, this reminds me of you guys. And we successfully destroyed some spores up here. How is this going? 8 million? And it's just fluctuating. Yeah, it's not really going down. You... You are going down. Are you going down? That is counting... Not down. Okay, we need more radiation, I guess. Let's see how... Let's see what we can do. Maybe put the thing... Here. Here. Let's see how it goes. Um... You have access. Let's uh, this part. Uh, how are we coming down here? This is fine. This is good. Okay. You are fine. I need to get rid of these before they can blossom again. Should be not a problem at all. You just go in. Uh, I'm confident in my radiation. And what's your temp issue? Yeah, not so confident. 
I'm actually it's gonna stay cold now. Yeah, it's gonna stay cold. It's all nice and cold around here. Good. Now, pips. Do I want cuddle pips? I want one in here. For sure. Do I want more than that? Let's have both of them here for now. Um, and then we have normal eggs. We have stone hedge eggs. There was only two stone hatches here. Yeah. Normal eggs. And you can be eight now. This was just for setting all things up here at one point. Mm, yes, that sounds all good and dandy. Do you bring you did bring all the hello cards here? Dick? No? Can't do any of that? That's great. Uh, the nosh beans are secure, so we can do this much. And I want you all dug up. And I want you dug up quickly. That should do the trick right. Because I don't see the priorities. No, it doesn't. That's interesting. So, I give you a command. What if I do this? It just doesn't work. That's fun. What's your errand like? Not very high. Uh, regardless, rescue the beans. Um, yes, you gonna be a double. I don't need a double right now, but still. Glass forge. It's the next thing I want here. Uh, we're not gonna build our own forge this time. We're gonna use what the game provides us with. It can be mopped. We'll take a bit of time here and then power. That's a bit. It's gonna be a bit ugly. Oh, actually. I wouldn't mind if I moved the hydrogen gen. Hydrogen gen. The hydrogen generator. Over here somewhere. Maybe move this up. Let's have it all a bit more closely together. Uh, you're not bringing anything to this particular. Oh, you do. Do it like that. I have no idea what this door is all about, but uh, now it's gone. Okay, and then power. And batteries. Raw power. Conductive wire? We could use that. I guess. It's not gonna get super hot here, it's gonna be livable. And we leave it that way, we keep it that way. So sure, why not? You just go up somewhere in the center. Oh yeah, and uh, since this is a glass forge and it exchanges the glass and heat with the tile it sits on, um, I will replace this with a mesh tile. Airflow tile. I don't know which one it is going to exchange heat with. Um, and so it will only have conductivity to the oxygen below, which is gas, which should be slower. And I will go one step further and put a few tiles below that, which has this bit is filled with CO2, which exchanges heat even slower. So you should be the forge for this. Only very slowly exchange heat. Should be exchanging heat very slowly. Um, good. And then a bit of piping here and there and everywhere. And it's going to be very simple. You come up. Do it I make this big. Make as much out of the room as we can. Uh, actually, you'll be open. Go up. And then we'll go squiggly lines. This can be normal stuff. This can be insulated. It really doesn't matter all that much. And uh, then we want to get some oil in. Maybe like so. And then we can actually just go ahead and copy paste that. The game allows us to do that. Uh, or not. Copy. There we go. Of course, we missed one bit here. That's fine, okay. 
uh, without a order you're only gonna take it take in 800 kilograms each plus the pipe that we have already in place i guess that's fine or do i want to restrict the stuff inside i can always just drop a bit of oil up here or whatever do some nonsense with that uh hold on it's gonna be open right so we can push the liquid off um gonna use brine sure brine is my favorite And we even have a few open bottles already. Alright, this needs to be a proper tile for now. And printables. House food, 4000 calories here. It's not a lot. 70k here, including the macro, which is 30k. And you're still doing the digging job. Weird. Uh, how are things over to this side? Let's see. And down here, have plenty of things to do. What you're trying to tell me then is you need more help. Is that what you want to tell me? We did get the cooling to go in, which puts the water inside 26 degrees, this should be fine. You can be cut off. The cooling loop, oh my bad, I didn't want to steal duplicate time here. <laughs> Um, uh, what do we have? A yokel, a triphobia, we cannot take, tripophobia, and noodle arms with um, magic hands, engineering skills. Ooh, yokel interior, a ranch and farm, a oh, ranch and farm is almost a great setup as well. And we have engineering now, it's fine. Somebody has that skill by default already. Novometer versus a binge eater. Wee wee wee. Mimi, mama. Sure. 11 construction though. Yeah. That's fine. That's good enough. I don't really need that much construction. I just need to unpause the game for a cycle and things will be built. <laughs> it's just so many dupes. Oh my god. It's just so many dupes. Where's Mima? There she is. Uh, farming? Well, I guess. And then there's other things you can just help out with. Might even be a mistake to have so many farmers. Actually, you do the farming first. Uh, having so many farmers, which will lead us to... Well, them competing for jobs and slowing each other down because they take long journeys in order to get to things. The spots and spaces. That they don't need to be, because there's somebody next to it anyways. But they will be interrupted by the other dupes want to do the same job. Um, in general, do you prefer dupes with multiple skills or do you go for the one trick ponies? Um, I've been playing too much very hard difficulty and done space missions with them to not want to have the extra morale. I should get more, as you say, one trick ponies in this playthrough, I guess. It would probably be more efficient. Yeah, yeah, would actually be better, I guess. It's fine. We have too many dupes anyways. Are you all vacuumed? You are all vacuumed. I prefer the three skills for better morale. Yes, I say. On the high difficulty, I really like, like that a lot. But for this one, I guess the better work efficiency would be good thing i don't know just asking never sure about it either yeah you know if i if you don't need the morale and you have a number of dupes if you don't need them to be flexible and you can have them very much specific, uh, specialized i would say specialization is a bit stronger but 
but I didn't test it properly or anything, so... Just making an educated guess. Um, I did get this mod, which allows me to suppress those unnecessary messages. You're all good. So, just suppress those. Because these buildings are just the way I want them to be. And that's that. Oh, by the way, are you on the wrong level? You're on the wrong level. Can I have a... It's gonna be insulated. We can always replace it. Uh, we're hitting the hot part here. We do. Right, so all I want here from you is to make some room on the right hand side. Um, move all this over here. Sir. It's not important, guys. It's not important. See, that's why we don't need high skill labor duplicates. They all just come in and do do the job instantly. <laughs> uh, they are craving for the mines. They really do. All right, let's close that off. You are. Hold on, don't mop that yet. There's still a few bits and pieces we need to remove. Uh, solid, solid. Uh, done with it. And you're already being filled up. Wait, what? Oh, you're missing one piece of pipe. Okay, that's fine. Fine. Um, hydro generators. Hydro generators and... We need metal. I mean... I don't want to remove that yet. It's cobalt. Don't we have? We don't have any cobalt. Oh, and also we use this as a thingy room, right. I mean, we can do... We can still do that. Uh, you go here. But what do I make you out of lead? I mean, it is cold here right now. But don't I have some nice refined metal somewhere that I can use? Oh, also, I want to have uh, transformers. I really need more refined metal. Uh, can we just send over some iron? We should have a ton of iron here somewhere, right? Two tons. <laughs> well, two tons, that's not a lot. There is another in here. Sort of. Uh, you can't go down here. You can't go around here, right? Let's make that traversable. Um, do I have more? Iron somewhere in here that I can use. Free iron, no. The Badlands aren't... Well, they are bad. I guess. But not that great. You're finished. Oh, and we also have a layer of CO2 here, which insulates things, I guess, kind of. Uh, but yeah. Close it off like so. And I guess after that, we could drop this water. Sort of. Somewhat cold. We can build a thing here to drop it down into our tank. Um, for now, you have plenty of stuff to do though. So, it's not interfere with that. Uh, you are nice and cool now. The water is a bit too cold for. Uh, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. Could make the drop for the water, uh, for the oil. Uh, I did see, oh right, I wanted metal, right, that's why I'm here. This one is a bit derpy to get. Um, you don't need iron here, really. No. Because if we have iron, then there's only one thing we want to do with the iron. That is steel. <laughs> Plus, I don't have time for this nonsense right now. So we are gonna go ahead and just put in place a... Lead transformer on either side. Uh, hold on, oh, this, is, this is too big, right? This is too big. This is 100 tiles. And the transformer, the power, what's it called? Power plant can only be, oh, 96, nice. Uh, we are removing a few tiles here. So I guess that fits. Anyways, though, there's no point in not utilizing these tiles. 
bring out the transformers all the way to the brink. Um, on the issue is that we still do need this to be a room, which means we're gonna bring the wire through somehow. And to do that, we want a heavy conductive plate to be part of our wall, like so, and so, and waiting. Wait, God Creeper has nothing to do. Do we have our research finished now? Do you generate radiation? Yes, but no, because you're not hitting the right spot. Okay. Uh, the X will be brought into the right place. These are too many X. Hold on. Let's copy paste that. And move you over. It's all gonna start now. Uh, the ethanol can be brought over. Perfect amount. We still need to drop it on top of here. From all the way up there. Uh, right, so if we have extra shine bugs, we have no way of bringing them into here. I guess that's just how it is. Can't really fix that right now. We can't have a shine bug dropper. If we wanted to fix that, we would need to have a sort of um, a room that will be well that has the drop off, and once the shine bug is in, once the shine bug is in there we would have to then push the shamrock out by flooding it or something like that. It's all a bit uh, difficult to do. A bit annoying to do. Okay, but this is fine. Uh, and we are tuning our core element. I'm curious to see how well that goes. As in, if we will be able to pump out enough of this material of the gas that will come that will be generated alright I do want to insulate all this and uh, we can replace this tile I'm sure the chlorine is more so it won't be pushed away by the oxygen and the oxygen can't push down uh, as I said yeah because it's more uh, the chlorine can't get out because well, it can't go up because there's always going to be oxygen it has nowhere to push it to Okay, uh, we don't need that. I do want to make this into a different kind of room though. A uh, room for... Can be that. A, a room for uh, more trees. A lot of trees, actually. Because I want seeds. How do you pump the chlorine gas? Um, so, if you have a setup like this, right? You have the chlorine gas going into this specific tile when the door is open. And when the door closes, the chlorine gas has to go somewhere. And the chlorine gas doesn't care about this liquid blob being here. It will just go straight up onto this tile, because there is already chlorine gas here. That's just how the gas is moved by the game engine. And so this door compresses it into the room on the right hand side, from the left hand side. It's just an observation observation you can make or find info on the internet. And uh, well, Leo actually pointed this one out to me. We can not do this the other way around. Because if you have it like this and you occupy not a bit like this, and you want to put it to the left, it will just still go to the top right, right? Okay, and half of the trap gas goes back into the left room. Yes, the left hand part side goes back into the left half of the room. Um, so it basically moves... The more gas you have here, the more it moves. Because it's always percentage based. And so, if at, all, if at all we have the problem of getting too much gas out of the vent, so it is unable to move it all before it overpressures, we can just put in a second door above with a bit of a, uh, a thingy here. But 
brain. A bit of a uh, afterthought. <laughs> Man, so sad. So much playtime and still no clue. I mean... Isn't that normal? This is the beauty of the game. It just has so many things to discover. Um, also... Alright, oh, we have no calories. Also, we have no calories. We will over uh, overheat, over tune this to the point where we will evaporate this liquid. We need some oil in here. And, oh no. Oh no, why? I can't move all the beans at once. Okay. Secure them again. Just so they are secure, right? And then I need to build a fridge up here. Um, I need to move this to the side. So I can build the fridge on the top. So I don't have to move them all manually. Right, you cut this off, you cut that off. You change it all around. Starvation, that's a bit of a thing. How is your calorie count coming along? Um, not, not in air. Navy in air? Har? Welcome, and thank you for the follow. We can... Macro discounted. Mm -hmm. We can't remove it right now. Okay. We have like 40k here. 40? Yeah. Do I send food over? How is your production coming along? You're still too hot. Uh, the water is fine-ish. I guess we could cool it down with a bit of ice for a quick sec. Uh, would I care if it dropped to the left inside of wood? Yeah, it's gonna go down here, it's gonna be annoying. To Legit City, explained it well earlier today. You don't have to have two buildings to do things normally. You have buildings that interact with the game physics to do things. And it's how you put them together. Or something similar to that effect. Yeah, it's also why whenever I see people uh, say they want buildings to do X, Y, Z. Um... I feel like, no, you don't want buildings to do this thing, because you can make the game and the physics interact in a way that will have the same effect in a just way more creative way. And that's, yeah, that's just that. Um, right, I want a bit of a thing here. I want the, the water to direct itself into this pool, so if we have the water flowing down, it will thus eventually flow into here and not down to the lock towards our ice pile. So uh, we build a few things here real quick. And then we build a ice township plate up here which can just melt. Have some water on the floor. Uh, it will all come into here eventually. I want this empty as well. It's gonna be oil here, it's gonna be fine. Uh, hi man, I know your name but uh, from bad guy stream. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Cap Moda, you will be seen in many streams, just like Leo and I myself and many other people. <laughs> it's like a tight knit little community, I guess, for a lot of us. Um, I still need food. Do I still? I could make a bit of mush. I mean, it's just one guy starving. How long until you're ready? And how hot, warm, cold this thing's in here? Let's just build a few more of these. Uh, how many hatches do we have? A few being weird. Wait, what? What? Oh my god, game! Okay, yes, that's great. Um, mm -hmm. So we set up the drop-off at some point, but we could not see, we could not select adult stone hatches, and so we'd only counted the normal stone hatches, uh, the babies, and thus we have 24,000 hatches in here. Um, and again, I can't copy-paste that. I disagree. Oh no, I can't copy-paste it. Oh, you've just discovered that Stonehatch's age to adults. No, but I have not 
remember that I had to still check this box because the game doesn't know stone hatches will eventually get to an adult state. I mean, it wouldn't be that difficult to just have it able to select the thing from the beginning. It's like when you want ice to be mopped to a specific spot, but if you select ice and it's the only liquefiable you have, it will bring all the liquefiables there once they have been discovered and so you get poop water in your clean water because the game doesn't allow you to do things the way you want them to be. I know it was sarcasm, but I just wanted to go on a little rant here. And the tiniest of rant. Did I fix it over here? Here we have it properly. Bleachstone and slime always as MS as well, yeah. Well, the slime is gonna be eaten by the sage hatches. We have a, a few of these thingies. Oh, actually, we can mine this, I think. Um, here. I'm getting sidetracked again. Which brings me to not unpausing the game because we still have a starving dupe. And we need to fix our no longer baby hatches. Um, I'm at the point where I don't want to remove the Wii Sports. Now, earlier in the campaign I was like, oh actually these are making things cold and things are way too cold anyways, so uh, remove them. But at this point I kind of want to keep them. Because um, things are getting warm. Well, not that warm, but... Uh, you can't select these before having mined them, yes. Like with a baby hatchet, yeah, I, I know. <laughs> it's just... It's great if you are playing the game for the first time, so you can discover things. I get that. But once you know the game, there's no reason for it. Not really. Um, I can't auto wrangle those now because we have that changed, right? So I will just go ahead, do that. Punishment is the reason. <laughs> right. I still don't know how this got displaced. Talk about water getting displaced. Did you? No, this lock is just fine. Didn't get displaced. Um, get a bit of salt water, move that over here. And because you're being iffy with these things, I'll use oil on top of that. And uh, I'm sure this movement command is going to be super important for a lot of duplicates and it will be done. No problem. Okay, the hatches will be moved over here. Starvation is already gone. Uh, how's research coming along? Still going. Uh, is this also? I saw you have very few hatches. No, it's all fine. Okay. Our things over here. Can't replace that yet. Um, do we have room up here? By the way, you are room size 100 tiles out of 120. This is completely unnecessary, but I do want to have a bin with all the data banks in here. Just because. Uh, you're all the ba 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 gonna be reset. And we can now put in this fridge up here. Copy Pastorino. Wrangle, wrangle, wrangle. And you should be brought over here, no issue, right? Uh, how the temps in here? Oh, they're nice and pleasant. Uh, you're gonna be too hot. How hot is the water in here? 40 almost. You can take 40 degrees, Mr. Tree, yes? Mrs. Tree? 40 degrees, but no more. So we are gonna move that back to normal stuff. Just give it a bit of a heat spike or something. Uh. Okay, now I'm paranoid about things not being set up the way I want them to be. Plus, um, can I get the oil bottle? Maybe. It's a lot of meat, <laughs> eventually. Empty the crude oil. Why do I have Widow Rainy selected? She's not even here. Oh, the, she was here for a second, okay. Pip, 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 pip. Stone, stone, pip, stone. Salt water. There we go. You're always here. Good to see. Good 
good to see you. I'm like a little. I'll be having a lovely Sunday. And, well, that's gonna be quite a bit of food. Oh my god. The food will just drop, it's gonna be too much. It's just gonna be too much, isn't it? Uh, okay. There's that, and still no metal. I stayed up until 5am making fresh buns, nice. Oh, I did read about you wanting to make buns. All kinds of berry or whatnot, right? Uh, how many? Three? That seems fine. Four? Do I want to put anything else down here? Oh, right. Yes, I do. So, you're good because the ones need finally are fulfilled. <laughs> nice. And what about the dogs? Did they get some special treat as well? I don't take it they get buns. I take it they don't get buns. Uh, let's hook you up this way and maybe it's they love buns. Maybe I'm just super finicky about feeding dogs. Yeah, well, my sister's dog is very sensitive to certain foods with allergies and whatnot, so... Every time I see human food I'm thinking, no dog food whatsoever, but... Then I remember the past and, well, dogs just eat everything. Room for second battery, maybe. Yeah, I, I was thinking that for a second. Come here. Oh, excellent. It's a lovely animation, no? It's it's beautiful. It's it's really something. I feel my dog. I feed my dog to human food, but I only eat meat, so. <laughs> Well, I guess that buffs out. It was her choice. I am pro-choice. She had made that choice. She's gonna live with it. Or die with it. Alright. Um, I do want for this pipe to be insulated. I don't want extra heat coming in anymore. Yeah. You go up and over and uh, this way. Yeah, the rover did the same thing. Like, had it stuck with its head in the tile, in the floor, in the ceiling. Uh, where's all this coming from? Hello? Oh, yeah, it's melting from. No. This would be trapped. Where's all this saw? Oh, right, I... No. Hmm. Uh, beans. And... Get rid of those. And... This is important? Not really. It's minus 20, whatever. Is it hydrogen? Oh my, this is actually a freezer. If we have enough hydro up here. Yes, the rover chose to build the tile on its head, and it stayed there until it powered down, since there was no one on the planet. Oh my god. Yeah, that's why you don't send duplicates alone as well. <laughs> they will just do that. Uh, how are you doing? Oh yes, of course. CO2. Um, I can build on this tile. Well, let me think. I can build this tile. You will... No, I can't. Oh, you're still active. Is that why? I have an issue here, yes. Right, okay. So I want the, the water to be somewhat reasonably distributed above, among those two... four tiles. I guess it doesn't really matter. It can be like this. You can be like do that for now. Uh, I still don't know where this came from. The salt water, brine, or do I? Do I? No. Will this turn into an oxygen duplicator by accident? 
No, it shouldn't be duplicating anything. I specifically don't I specifically don't want to duplicate things in this run. I'm not even making a uh, infinite liquid storage because of that. Because liquid storage will turn things into infinite uh, duplication nonsense at some point if you have super high masses. Uh, that should bring something, okay. I really do, do need that reminder. Um, did I not tell you to bring oil over here? Or did you move that again? And is this... What is displacing things here? I mean, it keeps my meat fresh by not making it into meat yet. I guess. Uh, let's make this into... Three hatches. One. Two. Wait, I can't copy the setting of the hatch. Three. And then you're back to eight. Uh, why? You know what? Have some fun with combat. So I have an easier time seeing this. Then, if we have a bit of... I don't even know where the other liquid went. It's not here anymore. It just vanished. Hmm. Uh, I'll take that one. Or do I have a 30 grams thingy somewhere? So it doesn't spread out. I don't think so. Well, this one will be fine as well. Um, Entombed. Oh, why, oh, why am I not surprised? Let me move you over then. Um, and two. Oh, yeah, that's great. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. If I open up the top, it's gonna be even better. Did you build my liquid guidance? You did. And this temperature plate doesn't even. What the heck? It's super cold. Uglabisk, good day to you. How is it going? Happy Sunday to you. Um, wait, that's more than one. Wow, I don't, I don't know what they're doing in this tile, but it looks disgusting. Um, here. Help them. And once this is done, this part as well. And, uh, well, actually, if you're here... You can dig all of this out. Watch the sand fall on top of it. Oh my god, we could completely bury them. Um, <laughs> let's not do that. Wait, would they suffocate? No, they can still breathe from here, right? They can breathe sideways. Yeah, they should be able to do that just fine. Uh, how is my wall coming along? We filled the wall and um, it looks beautiful. This is all closed off, right? So there's no harm in opening up the CO2 vent, which uh, spews out 500 degree nonsense. Maybe restrict the movement here, after all, a little bit. Just a little bit. Starvation? I don't think so. Right, uh, Lyra, help them. Oh yeah, no, we're not waterboarding them. No, no, it's, it, it's an accident. I did not intend for them to be flooded. Well, it's roughly the size of a two-year-old child. If the child were liquid, we're not really liquefying anybody wanted. yet. We tried that. Loops cannot be liquefied. <laughs> no! Don't destroy the water. Here. I'll wait for the water to escape. Okay. Is it just me or is the stream lagging for anyone else? As in I'm way behind? Like I'm responding very slowly? Oh, sure. I guess. Close that off. And... Well... 
Welp. It could be lower. That's an easy fix. Maybe it's just my... Oh, I'm actually having a few drop frames. Oh, actually I'm having a crappy upload right now. Hold on a sec. A good time for a break anyways. Um, I'll be back in three minutes. <laughs> 